Praise the Lord. Welcome to our brief Bible reflections. This is the day that the Lord has made. We will rejoice and be glad in it. This week we've been encouraging one another that it is good to allow God lead us, advise us, watch over us, and by all this we must commit ourselves to Him. Today we are looking at uh, Psalm 37. You read verse number 3 and 4. The Bible says, Trust in the Lord and do good. Then you will live safely in the land and prosper. Take delight in the Lord, and he will give you the desires of your heart. Praise the Lord. Trusting in God is everything. As we keep saying, we let God lead, guide, watch over us. It calls upon each and every one of us to commit ourselves in trusting the Lord. You cannot say you are letting God lead you, yet you are trusting in horses and chariots. The psalmist reminds us that we must trust in the Lord. And when we trust him, we also do good. We endeavor to do good. It is not automatic for us to do good as a human race. We have choices to make. But when you trust in the Lord and do good, the Bible says you will live safely in the land and prosper. You will live safely in the land and prosper. When you trust in the Lord, you do good. The product is that you live safely and prosper. Verse number four is a call to all of us again to take delight in the Lord. Take delight in the Lord and he will give you your heart desires. We desire that God may fulfill our heart desires but we delight ourselves in other things. God is calling us to delight ourselves in him. Take delight in the Lord at all times. Let the Lord be your delight. And when you delight yourself in the Lord, he does not strain or struggle to give you your heart desires. Friends, as we talk about letting God lead us, trusting in him is key. Doing good is key. And again, taking delight in the Lord is very, very important because God will give us the desires of our hearts. He will meet us at the point of our needs. When you look at all this, trusting in God, taking delight in the Lord, it's a call that we cannot do this while far away from God. We must endeavor to be in the Lord. Serving in the Lord, walking in the Lord, you know, doing all what we do in the Lord. He takes the center part of everything. And so the call here today is trust in the Lord and do good. Are you trusting God? Are you doing good? Delight or take delight in the Lord. And again, the results are that God will give you the desires of your heart. When you trust in him and do good, you will live safely in the land and prosper. Who does not want to prosper? We all desire that we may prosper in all ways. If you want prosperity, trust in the Lord and do good. We all desire to live in secure, you know, secure areas and uh, under that good security. Good security, because the Lord says, you will live safely in the land. Good security is only in God. Desire, desires are met in him, because when we take delight in him, he is willing to meet us at the point of our needs. That desire that is in, in your heart, the Lord is willing to meet or to fulfill it, but you must take delight in him. Praise the Lord. I wish you a lovely weekend. Have a blessed time. Keep trusting in the Lord. Do good and the Lord will prosper you. The Lord will give you total security. The Lord will meet you at the point of your need. In the name of the Father, Son, and the Holy Spirit. Have a blessed weekend. Shalom. This has been a week of flowers. And so we are also not left behind in this Bible reflection. God bless you. Enjoy. Shalom.